Hi guys, welcome to the short video about how to reset uh, Windows 10 PC, especially here a mini PC. And uh, in this case, we have a B uh, B Max. Uh, there are a lot of problems with these uh, small devices if you want to reset. So usually when we have like Windows 10, we just can hit the Windows key or uh, press here and then we can write reset. And then there's an option here which you can uh, choose here. And yeah, then we can go to advanced setting. I mean, the, the normal setting would be here, reset this PC, and usually it would work, but uh, usually it doesn't work with this. Uh, small mini PCs and we have we can go to uh, advanced options here uh, this is an option which you also can invoke uh, directly from start with hitting a few keys so the normal thing the normal alternate way would then be to use um, use a device and then you can choose like uh, you UEFIOS and that's a, a stick I mean I have you can hope you can see that here I have prepared a bootable Windows 10 USB stick you can download this from the official Microsoft website we'll put down the link to this page down into the description somewhere it's easy it's official everybody can do that you download the program you select which windows you need, uh, 32 bits, 64 bits and so on, you can prepare this stick. So actually we should be good to go, we uh, should be able to click here and then uh, it should uh, reboot or reinstall the windows from the USB stick, but the problem is it's not going to happen. So the question is then what can we do? Yeah, so here you can see the result. This is uh, like uh, it always happens. It comes back to Windows. Uh, all this window type of repair. You have this blue screen and you have these repair options. You can go also to repair and do all these crazy things. Yeah, the, it, it won't help. So the only way to do that is to reboot your PC and then go into the BIOS settings. I'm going to show you that. So we go into restart here. Takes a little bit of time. And as soon as we see the black screen, we start hitting the escape. Hope you can see that. Escape, yeah, until we are here in this screen. So we are in the BIOS setup here. And we have to use the uh, keys here to move around. So I go a little bit. I think the mouse doesn't work. Yeah, we go to the right side here. Boot. Hope you can see that. And then we go to the first option. Instead of Windows option, we select the SunDisk or yeah, whatever USB stick you have. And second option will then automatically be the old thing. So uh, it will first boot from the USB stick and we have to choose uh, F4, save and exit. So and yes, of course. And that's it. And now it will really boot from the USB stick. I don't know why it's not working from the Windows recovery or reboot or reset options. Uh, when you have a good installation of Windows 10, Windows 10 Pro, then it's usually working. So with this uh, devices here, all a lot of these mini PCs, they are, yeah, I'm not calling it fake, but they have some really special Windows 10 option and you can see it here. I mean, it's not totally reset. You have to be careful here. Uh, you cannot just uh, remove the USB stick and think it's done. No, it's not done now. You, we have to go here and uh, say, yeah, install now. And it's taking a little bit of time here. And it's just the installation of the clean new Windows 10. So let's say if you would then want to uh, reinstall or sell it. Uh, this is the thing which we are preparing. So... Don't stop at this moment here. We really have to uh, make this ready for a new installation. So it takes a little bit of time here. Yeah, and uh, sometimes it asks this question and we just say, I don't have the product key here. 
and it will then take the product key from the motherboard so that's a uh, yeah 2020 i mean that's that's uh, already since quite some time uh, that uh, the usually the serial is not we, we don't have to specify serial numbers and those things so um yeah we have uh, i think we had here the windows 10 pro here then uh, we accept the license go to next and now we have to select install windows only without keeping files yeah i want to overwrite everything now you have to choose uh, the largest partition that's really important don't uh, just go with the numbers uh, here we have megabytes 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 and here we have gigabytes so we need the uh, to install this on drive one just make sure that you really install uh, it where it has uh, the most space so that's here um, yeah, it contains files from previous installation. These files and folders will be re uh, moved to a folder named Windows All. Sometimes that's happening, sometimes not. I really have no clue when it's going to happen and when not. Just uh, yeah, make sure uh, whenever you uh, have like a new system and it doesn't have a lot of space, make sure that you check for Windows All and then delete this. So usually when you have such small devices uh, like this one where you have only 64 gigabytes of storage then usually it's not going uh, to use the windows old i've already been checking that a couple of times and it never did that so now you can see it says installing window this is really important that you uh, go the whole process here otherwise it's not installed it's uh, it, it's still the old windows only now it's uh, coping the window files and really uh, freshly installing the windows system yeah so here you are uh, took quite a while it was really long uh, on zero percent don't be afraid when it stays for pretty long on zero percent just leave it running even if it takes half an hour or so at the end we will probably see this screen and when you see this screen you know now it's time to set up windows again either for you or if you sell your pc then for somebody else if you're selling your pc just turn it off don't do anything so leave this to the person who buys the pc to choose the region and language and everything and so that's it for now i hope i've been able to help you a little bit with this video if you have any questions or comments or better solutions whatever you have please write everything down into the feedback area i'm always happy to talk about your things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe and channel thanks for watching and see you next time